Rifle has no problems. I mean, just with no problem. Oh my. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. The M4, baby. The cream of the crop of assault rifles in Modern War. Is that how you say that saying? Anyways, for today's video, we're going to be going over the M4 for Season 2 of Modern Warfare 2. If you guys have been living under a rock, the M4 has been a top-tier viable assault rifle to use in Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer. Does it still have the same, you know, title in Season 2? I think it definitely does. But in today's video, I dropped a MGB nuke with a high kill gameplay with this best insane M4 class setup for Season 2. If you guys enjoy the rest of the video and find it helpful, in any way shape or form guys only takes a couple of seconds to drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more modern warfare 2 class setups and videos i'm not going to keep you guys waiting let's go over the best m4 class setup to use here in modern warfare 2 season 2 all right guys and this is the m4 class what's different about this class versus the other m4 classes that i've made on the channel is I, i'm actually running an optic this time i never really ran an optic on the m4 i just thought it was a waste of attachment but i tried it out with this class setup and man i should have been using an optic a long time ago the optic feels really good on the m4 for some some reason i mean it just with this class setup it feels really good um didn't finish that guy up there but i mean easily manageable recoil control has the damage range let's go over the class setup so for the first attachment we're gonna be using the rf crown 15 muzzle for the horizontal and vertical recoil control i tried trust me i tried to use this thing without a muzzle and this thing the recoil on it was just wonky so i decided to throw in the rf crown i just felt like it had the best recoil control especially for horizontal and vertical recoil the tuning for that we're gonna give it a little bit of gun kick control to help with their recoil and give it obviously some recoil stabilization help as well now here's the barrel we use we use the 419 mm exf barrel and you might be wondering why not just use the high tower barrel i tested it i really saw no difference in like the damage range and things like that with this barrel versus this one here they all felt the same to me however what's great about this barrel is the cons are just ads and hip recoil control while this barrel actually has a movement speed con so movement speed i think is you know important in this game so having that really helps and just running this barrel i saw no difference in obviously the bull velocity and damage range now to help with the damage range in those rare cases i obviously up the damage range and up the recoil steadiness in the tuning now yes we obviously did run an optic like i mentioned before we ran the cronin mini pro that's just personal preference however if you don't want to rock a optic i'd recommend running with a laser you could also opt to go for the 45 round mag if you guys feel like you need more ammo as well and i actually tuned the optic this time a lot of people recommend me to tune my optics and i'm honestly gonna keep doing it every time we're on optics so we actually tune it to have max ads time i saw no difference with the graph and then adjust the close and far that's just personal preference next up is the rear grip the x10 grip for the sprint to fire speed and aim down sight speed just to kind of give this gun more mobility tuning for that we basically maxed out the sprint and fire speed and gave it a little bit of ads time to help with that last and final attachment is going to help with our recoil stabilization is the ftac grip or 56 under barrel for the aiming out of stability hit fire accuracy and recoil stabilization and of course tuning for that we gave it a little bit of aiming out of stability and just basically max out the recoil stabilization because it made no difference putting it here or putting it there so that is the full m4 class setup try this class setup man i think you're gonna like the m4 again for season two and enjoy the gameplay take care everybody the season two m4 does it still hold up as one of the top tier assault rifles to use in modern warfare 2 I would say it still holds up pretty well. I've been using it for the past couple of games and I've been enjoying it, dude. Every time I use the M4, I'm always I'm always a big fan of the M4 and every time I use it. And it feels no different. I think it got some sort of certain like nerf to it with the season two update, but it wasn't a nerf to like, you know, impact it to where it's like, you know, like not usable anymore. I think it had to do with like the burst feature on it or something like that. That guy is like an LMG of some sort. I'm gonna try to flank these guys. Was I able to do it? There's another guy in this corner here. I'm stuck on this wall. Okay, it looks like they're away now. Teammate is trying to melee me for some reason. I couldn't even see him. Dude, that guy is a freaking LMG. I could not even see him at all. I should have popped the UV. What am I even doing? Okay, it looks like they're still in the hard point. All right, about to pick it back up here. I got a battle rage of some sort. Oh my God. Another UAV, I'm just gonna pop that as well. There's a guy swimming in the water. Oh, these guys have a trophy system. You guys are not playing around. Oh my god, dude, these guys are not playing around. Holy crap. Spawns are flipping. Oh my. Dude, 
Oh, man. I forgot that spot even existed. Is he up there still? This guy, I think he's up here still. Dude, look at him. This little guy. <laughs> Chilling in the corner. Oh, yo! Oh, my God! Dude, this lobby is confusing me. I have no idea what's going on. Pop this. Throw that over there. I probably shouldn't have done that, but that's okay. Just gonna pop this advance now. I made the mistake of waiting on it the last time. I'm just gonna pop it now. It looks like they're flipping back here now. Buddy, where are you going? Oh no, Charlie. No, don't do that, man. Some of these guys are not playing around. Oh, teammate. Okay, they're spawning back here. This is my time to shine. Oh my god. Jeez Louise. Barely lived that. I can't tell if he's above or below. He is above? Yep, he for sure is above. Is he above too? Yeah, he was. Oh, not the flash. I'm so used to playing ranked that I thought I was going to kill my teammate. Oh, no. Okay, we're, we're doing fine. Oh, maybe not. Oh, bro is just laying. Just keep walking. Got a UAV. Should I wait to pop the advance? No, the UAV is showing us a lot of information. I think we're fine. Okay. Man, I'm really focused at the moment. Oh man, I could have gotten that second guy, I think. We have another teammate kind of going off too. I don't know where these guys are at. Oh man, they're spread out. The only thing I can go off of with these... Oh man, that's... Yeah, that is their gas. Oh, my aim was so off there. What was going on? Shout out to that teammate for saving my life. I appreciate you a lot. Guys are like going in the water. What is this guy doing? I had no idea what that guy was doing. I'm kind of I'm kind of zoned in right now. Okay, run a brutal 25. Oh my god. I think there's guys close to me. I'm going to back up. Try to go up top here. I have no UAV, nothing to really know where these guys are at. I think I might be one kill off. There we go, baby. MGB with the season two M4. Man, this thing still feels so, so, so good. I want to try to keep the streak going. Oh, as I say that, I literally died. It literally died right after I got the MGB. Let's pop the VTOL and let's end this game off with a freaking bang. Oh, baby, the M4 still feels really good for season two. If you're looking for a solid M4, or solid, not solid M4, solid AR, definitely want to go with the M4 for sure. Oh, you can get on top of this? I had no idea you can get on top of this. Wow, this is new information to me. I just don't play this map too much, I guess. Oh no, I'm flash. I want to see if I can get a kill from up top of here. Oh no, wait. Got him. That is actually kind of clutch. I had no clue about that spot. I might be a noob. Call me a noob. I had no clue about that. You can get on top of that.
55 kills. I feel like we could we could have done better this game, but that's okay. I'll take it. We still got the rest of the game though. Unless our teammates are just gonna sit on the uh, the hard point. And yeah, my VTOL is going off. Oh, they just took out the VTOL. Yeah, like I said, the M4 still feels really good, man. And uh, this is the first time I'm using a, a, an actual optic on it. I hardly ever use optics on my M4 builds. Well, we're trying it out today just to kind of see how it feels. I should have gone for that guy. Oh, no. I should have gone for that guy. Yeah, I think they're going to end, uh, end the game here. I'm just going to call in the MGB now. There we go, baby. MGB called in. MGB with the M4. Probably like my many MGBs with the M4. I will take that. Not a super high kill game, but I think the first clip of the video kind of shows the power of the M4. So there you go, man. And dude, half their team left. Oh, man. Come on. Anyways, there is the M4 in Season 2. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like and subscribe, and I'll catch y'all later. Take care, everybody.